Hi everyone, Patty here with a quick project share. I wanted to show you how I packaged up some items using dollar store products and just a few sheets of paper. Um, this is a package going out to a sweet friend of mine. Um, it's just a little package. It's not for a swap. It's just kind of like a thank you for um, a recent package that she sent me and so I wanted to share with you what I'm including in her box or some of what I'm including in her box. I have showed you this in a previous video. It's just a dollar store container that I added some sequins to and added a belly band to. Um, I did go ahead and add this spoon under the belly band. I had that separate, but I thought it would be cute to have to add a little Velcro dot to that. Um, and so the recipient is able to use this to make sequence mixes, but then she will be able to just stick that back onto her container um, and then also stick the belly band back on. Um, this sequence and container is from the Dollar Tree. It comes in, the sequence comes in a pack of five. So I used two packs and what I did is just put in two colors of each. Um, so I, that's how I filled this container up. I thought that was cute and just a cute way to send a little gift to your pals um, and then I have this Dollar Tree vinyl pouch that I think is so cute they come in different colors they have green and purple they all have a different um, little phrase in the front this one says choose to shine I added just a little handmade tassel that I received in some happy mail and then inside I've added some Dollar Tree goodies um, I thought it would be fun to add some of these seed beads so that the recipient can use these along with the sequence to make some mixes. I also included one of these um, organizer boxes so that the recipient can create her own as well. I thought that was cute um, to add in there. I added in these finger protectors. I love these finger protectors. The color is so cute. And then I also added one of these um, Dollar Tree embossing stylus. So all of that fits in nicely in this package right here. And it's just a cute way to send some crafty goodness um, to your pals. It's kind of like Tetris though. You've got to squeeze everything in there just right so that it'll close just right. I don't want to close it. I don't want to mess up the zipper. I need to fix that a little. And then let me move this out of the way. Finally, I created this little um, suitcase right here using the Dollar Tree clear containers. Um, this is such a neat idea. Lacey from Laces and Ribbons came up with this. She has a tutorial on how to create one of these. Um, it's so, so simple. It's basically just adding these straps um, and the little handle and maybe a liner to the boxes. Um, some people have added or glued these boxes together so that when you take this box off, you also take this lid off and that just gives you less moving parts. I um, have not done that to any of the ones I've made. I think it's kind of neat to just be able to take this off and keep this one closed. Um, but anyway, in here, I have made some flowers, some um, tiny rosettes, some butterfly die cuts, that's the top compartment and then the bottom compartment has some um, little photo frame die cuts, some bows, and then just some gathered paper um, little banners that are stitched. And so that just fits right on here. 
I've used um, some glue dots to hold this all together. I added some little flowers on here that my friend um, Crystal sent me in a recent swap that we had. And then on here, I added this little key ephemera piece from the, what is it, Sweet Story, Maggie Home Sweet Story collection. This tassel that I recently picked up from um, BB Crafts. And then look at these little beads, guys. I went ahead and made one. I was able to add some of the sequins in there and just glue the tops on with the E6000. And then I added some little key die cuts to that. So just really simple, fun way to share some goodies with your pals. I thought I would share this with you before I wrap it up and um, send it out. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you soon. Bye for now.